Lesson 14. Review 2. In this module, you worked with four inverse formulas, two for circles and two for rectangles. When you know the area of a circle, you can find its radius by dropping pi from this value and taking the square root of the result. For example, if a circle has an area of 144 pi, its radius equals 12 because the square root of 144 equals 12. When you know the circumference of a circle, you can find its diameter simply by dropping pi from this value. For example, if a circle has a circumference of 18 pi, its diameter is 18. When you know the area and the length of one side of a rectangle, you can find the length of the other side by dividing. For example, if a rectangle has an area of 24 and a height of 3, its base is 8 because 24 divided by 3 equals 8. And finally, when you know the perimeter and one side of a rectangle, to find the other side, divide the perimeter by 2 and subtract. For example, this rectangle has a perimeter of 14 and a base of 5. To find its height, divide 14 by 2, which equals 7, and then subtract 7 minus 5 equals 2. So the height of this rectangle equals 2.